What's up everybody? Well, I got another Asus G15 Advantage gameplay video for you guys today. And today, we're gonna try some Star Ocean, the Divine Force. So, basic plan for this one is we're gonna try this at 1080p and 1440p, and we're just gonna probably skip the secondary computer, move right on to the primary computer, because I don't think I did any of the other, what you would call it, Tales games on the secondary computer, because most of them didn't support ultra wide. Now this one might, but if it does, we'll try it out. If it doesn't, we'll move on to the main computer. I think that sounds fair. But anyway, why don't we now go ahead and get this guy hooked up up to that capture computer there and that way we can look at the settings real quick go get a little gameplay if we have to and can't max it out we'll go through the settings and see what it's like through all the settings but anyway why don't we now go ahead and get started well all right before we hop into the game here let's go look at over the settings we're gonna max out the field of view it's gonna be at 1080p you can only do 60 fps you can't go any higher than that so i'm gonna just leave vsync on so we're not getting shit tons of screen tearing no point in turning it off and not getting more than 60, you know? But anyway, now that we're done with that, let's go look at the settings. We're just gonna max the game out, see how it does. It should be able to handle this, no problem. But I have a feeling it's gonna be one of those games where it can play it no problem, but it still drops under 60 a bunch just because of it being, you know, not the most optimized thing in the world. And I let the shaders optimize in the beginning. You don't have a choice, you can't skip it like you can in some games. It's kind of a better thing, you shouldn't skip uh, shader or compiling shaders. The game will run even worse than it does with. <laughs> anyway, to the game. Well, here we go. We are in the game. But as I thought, it, it, this game is so easy to run. Even my GPU is just chill. It's just chilling. We're not even at a gigahertz most of the time. But whenever this kind of stuff happens, you get lots of little stutters under C like that down under 60 because it has to sit there and clock up and clock down and all this other shit. But in a game like this, it doesn't really matter that much. And it kind of seems like once you do the move, it doesn't really lag like that for that move again. You have to like do all your moves to get him like into the memory or something like that. At least that's what it seems like is happening. I am not a programmer, so I don't know how any of that shit works, but all I can call is what I sees. Alright, so we gotta head all the way over there, do we? Yeah, it's quite a distance away. But whatever, we can get enough fights along the way and enjoy the scenery. Though it being nighttime, this is probably gonna be hard for me to get camera for a gameplay, but I'm still gonna give it a fucking try. It might not turn out so well. Oh yeah, gang up on him and kill him. And here he goes, he is defeated. And now we can move on. Ooh, there's a chest over here. Let's go see what's in here. Ah, a guarding ring, huh? I'll have to equip that a little later. Oh, here's quite a few people. Damn. All right, let's rumble. Ow. Ah, oh, he's a chief scumbag. I was wondering why he was taking so many hits to kill. There we go, we got him though. And another chest for us. Fresh sage, huh? Alright, we gotta go this way. Alright, is there any chests or anything over here? No, but there's this thing. 
Alright, so we can destroy target areas. Let's just read this real quick. I don't generally like being on these screens too long for you guys, but at the same time, I like knowing what to do. Otherwise, I just sit there and look like an idiot and just run around in circles. <laughs> so. And we gotta beat the Chimera. Damn, it hit me anyway. I was hoping I could pull a Goku versus Frieza and just, like, bring it back at the motherfucker. I need a heal. I'm almost dead. All right, though. So let's see. Use item. Blueberries. There we go. Ooh, there's random things to smash in here. I believe I get stuff from these. Yes, I do. All right, I think that's where I fought all those guys. So yeah, I guess we can start heading towards our goal then. There doesn't seem to be anything else for us around here. Gotta go back and get some. There we go, we got him. And now we can continue heading up. Up, up, and up. Take that, scumbag. Ah, we got another chief scumbag, though. Alright. He is toast. Now we gotta finish this last one off. And there we go. Now we can care. Heading up. Man, there's a lot of stairs to wherever I'm heading. Damn. It's like we're heading to the top of a mountain or some shit. What do we got here? Ah, Pansilia Leaf. Anyway, though, I'd say this is probably a great time to move on to camera. Well, all right, guys, let's get ourselves a little camera gameplay now. Aqua berries, eh? Well, that sure seems useful. Let's see. Alright, it looks like we've gotten to the ruins. What is it indeed? Oh, 
uh oh. What's going on now? Well, that's an interesting looking little ball thing. <laughs> All right. Oops. What do we got here? Exciting, all right. <laughs> Kicked all their asses. Uh oh. Apparently they have. Take that, feet. I will defeat the feet. Ouch. Or I will die. One of the two. Alright, wow, I managed to barely win. I thought I was gonna lose. I think I got down to one person there. Yeah. All right, though, I think that's plenty of camera recorded gameplay, so why don't we go and wrap this video on up now? Well, all right, guys, that is a wrap for Star Ocean, the Divine Force. At 1080p, anyway, we'll go and do some 1440p next. Doesn't support ultra wide school, so we'll skip the secondary computer and head right for the first. And that right there, I, I think almost all of the games, besides one that I've done today, so did not support ultra wide. And that's one of the reasons why I moved it to a secondary monitor instead of a primary. I got tired of having to go for fixes and this, that, and the other thing. It's a great immersive experience when it works but pain in the ass when it doesn't but in any case that is all I got for you guys for this particular video I sure hope you guys enjoyed watching the video cuz I sure as hell enjoyed making it for you guys and until the next video peace out guys